long hands and I had them lights. That some people had them umbrella lights. Mm -hmm. to you about the selfie powders from Too Faced. Um, this isn't, it's still relatively new, but it isn't uh, brand new, new to Too Faced. Um, you probably already have seen other people talk about it or just seen it in general. Um, and I figured I'd come on here and talk about it because I had some people ask me questions, uh, you know, like what they do or, you know, if I notice anything or, you know, all these, all these different questions I figured I would, I would answer. So that's why I wanted to do the video. Um, mind you, I never tried the Hourglass Ambient Powders. I know like that Trio set, some were trying to compare this to that, but I really don't think you can compare this palette to that palette. Um, and I will explain why I don't, I don't feel that you can. I mean, I don't have the Ambient Powder, so this is just my guess on it. Um, because from seeing what the powders look like when people so, show it, it is um, in a really cute packaging. You know how Too Faced is. They always have such very cute packaging, which um, this is all in reference to for the Instagram that so many people are on. I am not on Instagram. I don't even own a cell phone. I know, I know, that's probably craziness to some people, but... No, I do not own a cell phone, so therefore I do not have Instagram. Sounds fun, and I wish I did, but as of right now, no. Pretty adorable. It is a adorable packaging. It's the um, cardboard, kind of not flimsy cardboard, but it's it's pretty adorable. Uh, did I say it's thirty six dollars? I don't know. I'm already having a brain for it, and I can't even think of it. But it does have a mirror in there. I don't want to blind you guys, but it does have a mirror. Um, and here are the powders right here. But like you that have. is a like lilac lavender color. This is a bronze, and then this is like a yellow color. Now, the lilac purple one is called Moon River. Um, this is called Totally Toasted, the bronzy colored one. And then the yellow one, the golden yellow color, is called Sunshine. So it's light reflecting uh, photo enhancing powders. And I guess pretty much what they did this for is if you're, you know, going to a place, like somewhere where they're going to be taking pictures. Um, like maybe it's your wedding, maybe maybe it's a banquet, maybe um, it's the prom, snowball, you know, for, you know, whatever, you know, like maybe there's some important uh, get-together coming up and, you know, pictures are going to be taken for that get-together. Um, this is supposed to uh, kind of give you that real nice photo finish, flawless look. Um, to the pictures. It has, uh, selfie powders are your filters for the real world. Our collection of weightless, undetectable finishing powders mimic the effects of your favorite photo filters by using light fragmenting technology to instantly brighten and with diffused warmth, bronze with a smoothing glow to add a cool ethereal light to your skin. Get close-up perfection in photos and look filter flawless in real life. I've been using this for a while now, like I feel like I said I can tell you my thoughts on it. Um, do I think it's gimmicky? No, I do not. 
I, I know some people might think it's gimmicky. I don't, I guess I don't feel it's gimmicky because now I love Too Faced. I love the packaging. I like to collect a lot of their stuff. So mind you, that's another reason why I had gotten this because I'm not no, I'm not somebody that goes out and always takes professional pictures or does whatever or any of those kind of things. Um, but however, I don't feel it's gimmicky. I know some people, um, I have noticed they have more darker skin tones, um, kind of give it, I'm not saying everybody, but like some of them are kind of like not impressed with it. I'm not sure. Maybe it works better because I'm very fair complected. So keep that in mind. I am somebody that's fair complected. So for me, I do notice on myself, like not extreme, like it's not like my face is going to be purple or extremely bronzy or extremely yellow. It's not that. So the lilac color, the Moon River, just brightens up your look. It almost reminds me of um, the Fergie, what is it, the uh, Take on the Day Mattifying, and I know there's like NARS and all those kind of powders. It almost reminds me of that where this brightens up your look. I, so I found this to be good to put under my eyes, um, to set, you know, like whatever under my eyes if I want to, just, just do that, or all over my face, or any places that I want to brighten up. That's what I found this one to be helpful for. Um, for the totally toasted, the bronzy color here, that one, it doesn't give you if you put a bronzer on, you know how like a bronzer really, you know, obviously it bronzes up your face, your complexion. With this, it adds more of a bronzy glow to your skin. It's not like extreme. Um, like obviously you want to, you wouldn't want to take your brush and like really go in there and pack on the powder, but it's not like you're going to go ahead and dip in there. And be like oh snap you know like you you didn't tap off and it goes on and gives you a nice bronzy glow so for those days maybe you know like you have a nice tan going on and you want to add a little more something to your tan um, or anything like that this would be the one to go for which that's probably what I'll do I have um, used it just in conjunction with itself it's not like like I said it doesn't going orange or cakey or any of them kind of things. It just filters and goes over on my skin and just gives a nice bronze glow. The Sunrise, the yellow one, I really like a lot. Um, that one you can use all over on your face. It's not going to make your face look yellow or anything like that or, um, you know, like major golden color. It just gives a nice glow to your skin, just the glow itself. And, um, you can just put it like, you know, maybe like where you want some glow to be, like like as a highlighter would do. Like if, if you're somebody that doesn't like highlighters that have like a lot of glittery or extremeness to them, like anything extreme, you can add this. When I take the yellow gold one and brush it along here, you can see it does add a glow, but it's not like, oh my gosh, you know, it's like real glitter, shimmery kind of a thing. So that's what I like to use the golden one for, like, you know, just to give a nice little hint of glow. So you can put it all over on your cheeks, just certain areas you want to glow. You don't have to put it all over if you don't want to. You can use all three of them. I've already done that myself, too, like where I put this, like, on my cheeks in certain places, like where I would highlight. I would use this to brighten up, like, under the eyes and everything, and then just kind of do a whole bronzed glow a little bit and you know in certain areas and stuff so I have used all three so they don't now like when you when you rub your fingers like there's the lilac one you can see the brightness to it already but it you know it's not like it's gonna be like extreme noticeable here's the bronze color that's the bronze color there and then here's the yellow sunshine color is on that and like even though you see it on my finger like that it's not like you're gonna really see anything major to you know your skin 
So I really like it. Is it something I feel like um, you, you need? Um, not really, unless you're somebody like me that does uh, enjoy Too Faced, collect Too Faced. Um, maybe you're somebody that does do photo pictures. Uh, obviously, if you're a makeup artist or something like that, you might want to add this into your collection to have, like, on those special occasion, kind of, like, when you're whatever, you know. I just, I got it because, yeah, I am a sucker a lot of times for packaging, I'm not going to lie. But I was also curious of what these were going to do, and I liked the idea of just trying them out and playing with them. But I am quite happy with them. It's not something I regret buying for my own self. Mind you, some people it might not be for, some might not really like it. Um, you know, you always hear mixed reviews, so it's not going to be for everybody. It sells Too Faced. If you're in anywhere where they sell Too Faced products, maybe try it for yourself. Like, I know they have the displays out, and, you know, maybe put your finger in and just, or whatever, you know, and, like, dab it in certain areas or something like that. Or you always, you always can, what, send it back or, you know, get your money back for it. But, um, I, I like it. I haven't had no problems with it. I haven't really been disappointed with it. It's not something that I was like, oh my god, this is the amazingest thing in the world palette, you know. It wasn't that, but I like it. Put it that way. I, I do. I like it, and I'm glad I have it. So, yeah, if that's any helpful to your questions for some of you guys out there that was wondering what um, to expect with this, that's pretty much what I can give you. Like I said, I can't compare it to the ambient powder. Oh, why almost forgot why I was saying um, I, I, I would say myself even though I don't have the ambient powder that it doesn't compare to is like especially like this bronzy um, color right here like I don't think the ambient powder has uh, right now like they have the single ones but in that trio they don't have like a bronzy color in there and this does like a you know like a nice glow like a nice kind of a glow so I don't know. I know there's bright light reflecting properties on a lot of theirs, but I'm not sure if there's one that actually makes you glow. But the bronze, I would say, would be the one thing that wouldn't you couldn't compare it to because there is no bronze in that third one that I know of. So, um, so keep that in mind. And I'm not sure how much that one is. I forget. I know it's a little bit pricey. Where this one's 36, it's still kind of pricey, but it's a little cheaper. So, you know, keep that in mind, too, if you wanted to try something similar to that, you know. Um, but, you know, if you want to save a budget and, you know, you don't care to have all three, then I would say get the Take on the Day um, from Vergi, which is definitely budget-friendly. So, anyway, views, hopefully you enjoyed that and liked that and found it helpful. Um, I so appreciate all my new subscribers. Thank you and welcome, and I hope you stay. And if you did like this video, please give it a thumbs up. I would so much appreciate it and it would help me out a lot. Thank you, thank you. And also, if you are not subscribed to my channel, go ahead and click the subscribe button down below. I would love to have you. You can join me each week. And I put up a couple videos in a week. And just, you know, join me on um, just different topics and everything. And as always, please, please remember to be yourself, love yourself, and let the real beauty shine through. So until the next time, we'll take care.